Andre de Grasse is a Canadian champion sprinter with a personal best in the 100 meters of 9.92 seconds. Jesse Owens is an American legend who took multiple golds at the 1936 Berlin Olympics, winning the 100 meters with a time of 10.3 seconds. We ran 10 3 right there. 10 3, that's in Berlin, yeah. Wow. So, how tall are you? 5'10. 5'10, he was 5'10. Uh, and what, what's your weight? Are you like 155. I, I think it's about the same. He was about 70 kilos, something like that. If these two men faced each other today, who would come out on top? Who's going to win it? It's very close. These are the kind of high tech runners that Andre de Grasse usually wears. But to make it a fair race, we're making him replicas of Jesse Owens' shoes. Look at those. Yeah, those are nice. So, how does it feel? It feels good. Instead of a modern synthetic surface, the track will be hard packed dirt, like the one in the 1936 Olympics. Yeah. So, there's your 100 meters straight. You can just see the finishing line down there. <laughs> now, he didn't have any starting blocks. Mm -hmm. So if you put your fingers down on the line and put your feet where they would go, and then we'll create some holes there, and then that in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. The time for Andre to beat is 10.3 seconds. With my hand timing, we've got just dead on 11 seconds. How do you feel? I don't think I've ever felt so tired <laughs> running 100 meters right now, so. But it does kind of show that, that the tracks, the shoes, does make a bit of a difference. Yeah, you I, said it's... I think it makes a really, really big difference. <sighs> it, it was tough. I think this will show a lot. This will show that Jesse Owen has a lot of strength and, and power. <laughs> wow. <laughs> the strength and power to win this equalizer challenge. 